Hey guys, it's Free Peace. Um, I'm really sorry that I haven't been around. Um, I know some of you have been um, emailing and calling and instant messaging saying that you really want to see some Free Peace stuff and um, I just haven't had it in me to put anything out there. Um, I, I, you know, I know you know how it goes. So, so enough of that. So, but thanks for checking in and I really appreciate that. Um, I've been around and I've been watching your videos. I just might not be commenting. Um, and uh, what else? Let's see. I got a housemate in and um, that's been going really well. He came in, I guess, a couple of weeks ago now, almost a couple of weeks ago. And um, that's going well. And I think we're getting another housemate on um, maybe Saturday, Friday, Saturday, this, this weekend. So hopefully that'll um, ease a lot of the burden, the stuff that's been going on since I've had very little work. Um, so that said, I started um, dog walking again. Um, I was a dog walker for 10 years and stopped about a year and a half ago and um, started up again last week. Uh, it's been slow going because it, you know, not a lot of people are hiring dog walkers or pet sitters, but it is the holidays. People might need pet sitters now. So I've put the word out there, and uh, what I'm actually doing is walk training, and you know, it's sort of like leash training, and uh, getting some really good results with this new dog that I'm working with, and I'm very excited about it. And it's like, oh yeah, that's what I used to do, and I really like it. So that's, I'm in my work clothes now. <laughs> These are my work clothes for however long this lasts. Um, and then I still have like one client that has a couple hours a week, if that, um, doing, you know, office kind of stuff and marketing and assistant work. Um, but I'm hoping, because I've gotten some calls from former clients of do dog clients that have friends that have new dogs and that kind of stuff. So hopefully I'll be able to build it up a little and and keep that going. I really like the training aspect a lot. Um, what else? You know that I had to get rid of the gardeners, and by gardeners I mean people that would come and blow the dust around and whack the weeds. Um, so it's been about six weeks, maybe eight weeks, and uh, now we have a um, mini forest of weeds growing in the back, but they're bright green. They're they're healthier weeds than they've ever been, um, and there are butterflies and bees and just bugs and birds like birds like crazy. It's just it's really beautiful out there, even though it looks like a junkyard. <laughs> um, I have some footage of that I'll show you, but um, this time of year is just my favorite in Southern California. Uh, Thanksgiving Day is my favorite day to take honey down to Venice Beach and walk on the boardwalk and just be in the quiet of everybody who has the day off except for the coffee shops <laughs> and restaurants. Um, so I'm, you know, I'm hoping to do that on Thursday. And, um, I also like have some creative stuff happening. Um, actually, a lot of creative stuff happening. I've been really working on power of thought, um, law of attraction, affirmations, just all the spiritual stuff that I really need to remember. And um, it's been a really good reminder because hitting hitting a bottom. I mean. I know it sucks when I hit the bottom, but I'm so grateful to be coming up from there. I mean, the, the gratitude is beyond anything. And it's the holiday season. It's like my favorite time of year. I mean, who? what better time? I don't know. I just feel really, uh, really grateful for so many things, so many things, for things that have happened that I didn't think I wanted to happen, things that are happening that I really want to happen. I just am grateful and, and learning a lot of patience. 
so. A little bit of a heartfelt vlog, I guess. But that's the way it goes. Um, so yeah. Um, I'm not sure what else to say except um, I just really wanted to check in because I hadn't been in a while. <laughs> so I'm going to go now. <laughs> okay, bye. So we emptied the pool. We flipped it over and this is what it looks like now. And I can't really... um do much with it. The mecca of the, the pool. It's still in really good shape. It's just um, I need hands to help me fold it up and, and put it away or or sell it or get rid of it or whatever. I've been trying to get rid of it but um, who wants a pool at, at the end of November even though it's beautiful out. I just think it's beautiful. I know it's all weeds, but it's beautiful.